Did you know that some people are so poor that all they have is money? So many people spend their life racing to the top of Success Mountain that they get to the top and realize that now they want to jump off because they don't like the view. And that's because there is a huge difference between a life-chasing success and a life-chasing fulfillment. And today I want you to contemplate on what is it you really want? Because if you're chasing certainty through material objects, I need to prove to the world I'm good enough by wearing a fancy watch. I don't wear watches. I need to you know, know that I have enough certainty by having the mortgage in you know, the bank for the next six months. There is no certainty in life. Right? Then you're missing the beat. You see, I had a, a business partner of mine, a beautiful soul, his name is Jan, and he got to the top of Success Mountain and then unfortunately passed away at 51 just a short time after. Never really got to enjoy it. And I watched him for years really you know, slave away. And I don't want that to happen to you guys. I want you to understand that life is about moving through the garden, smelling the roses while you're tending the garden. Don't say, right, I'm gonna grow the perfect rose bush. Then finally, I'm gonna sit back and I'll be able to enjoy it. No, fall in love with tending the garden for nurturing the rose, watching it bloom, then smelling the fragrance. What is it about your life that you're not appreciating because you're too busy being busy looking around the next bend? So just a, a pertinent message today on the time where it's the one year anniversary of uh, me losing my friend. I wanted to share that with you because uh, sometimes you know, we get there and we think, wow, is this all there is? We've missed our kids grow up. We've you know, lost relationships because we were too busy trying to build something that we thought we needed to be in order to be the person that they'd want to be with. Forgetting that the person they want to be with is us, not us being busy to try to get somewhere so they can be with us.